The mechanic uses the ruler for measurements that do not need to be precise. Most rulers can measure to within 1 16th of an inch and the machinist rule can measure accurately to 1 64th of an inch. The scale that should be chosen will be determined by how accurate the measurements need to be. Using the 1 8th scale will not be as accurate as the 1 16th scale. To understand how a ruler is read, one must understand the lines and marks on each scale. The large numbers on the scale are inches. On most rulers, the inch lines will be the longest lines on the ruler. The inch can be divided in half. The half line will be the second longest line. If the space between the half is divided into equal parts, these lines will be quarter lines. Notice that the quarter line is slightly shorter than the half. If the space between the quarter is divided into equal parts, these lines will be one-eighth. Notice that the one-eighth line is slightly shorter than the one-quarter. The eighth scale is broken down into eight equal parts and each line is one-eighth of an inch. The first line is one-eighth, the second one-quarter, the third is three-eighths, followed by one-half, five-eighths, three-quarter, seven-eighths, and one inch. If the space between the one-eighth is further divided into equal parts, these lines will be one-sixteenth. The one-sixteenth scale is broken down into sixteen equal parts and each line is one-sixteenth of an inch. The first line is one-sixteenth followed by one-eighth, three-sixteenths, one-quarter, five-sixteenths, three-eighths, seven-sixteenths, one-half, nine-sixteenths, five-eighths, eleven-sixteenths, three-quarters, thirteen-sixteenths, seven-eighths, fifteen-sixteenths, and one inch. Notice that the one sixteenth line is slightly shorter than the one eighth. In this example the scale is eighths. This means that each inch has eight equal marks. One can count all the lines up to the arrow and find that the arrow is on the five eighths line. In this example the scale is sixteenths. There are 16 equal lines in each inch. One can count all lines up to the arrow and find the arrow is on the 11 sixteenths line. In this example, the scale is eighths and the arrow is on the 4 eighths line, which is reduced to half inch. Any lines that are longer than the shortest one can be reduced. In this example, the scale is sixteenths and the arrow is on the five sixteenths line. 